hey guys good morning good afternoon good evening depending on when you're watching this video how are you guys doing this is, looks like a drone view but i had to stand somewhere up the mountain to do this view for you guys ah if you know this place here uh, it's called nav valley estate nav valley estate is located in asokoro the side when you're going from aya as if you are going to nyanya you turn right instead of going straight to nyanya you turn right and you, when you go right you see the flyover that takes you to nav valley nav valley is a very beautiful estate Be like um two or three years ago nav valley let's say two years ago nav valley you know duplex or yeah was going for five million naira per annum but right now they are going it's going for some landlords are giving for 6.5 some are giving for 6 million and some are giving for 7 million as the case may be you know every rent here it depends on the landlord because most people is actually the nigerian air force estate so a lot of people here sold their own houses to other people to invest in another place like you know how it is now when some who were maybe transferred from here they built the house and rented it some sold the house so i've been meaning to you know show you how nav valley estate looks like wow this estate it's beautiful very very beautiful so i thought that mm, my subscribers my viewers would love to see this estate like you know buying houses here there's a property that who, someone was looking for to buy in this nav valley and um it was going for the person was asking for 150 million i was like really so nav valley is this expensive but then again when you go as we proceed you see how beautiful this estate is it has very good road networks beautiful houses you know the, the um, it has very good landscapes you know they have shops here the place is just beautiful it's just beautiful if you ask me so guys um like i said in the other video if you want me to do any tour of your choice just let me know just let me know leave it on the comment section this is the church this church is actually they have the offices on the left and then they have a church here um for those who worship here they call it i think protestant church or so so they have a church here a very beautiful shopping complex so guys if you want me to tour any estate let me know because i live very far from Na Valley. i live very far from all these places i go to but you know my duty on this channel is to show you abuja show you all the beautiful places you've been hearing about take you to places that you ordinarily not even go to like a lot of people have told me wow like some people send me messages asking me how I, I just thought of this kind of beautiful concept where i just show you people abuja you know and i don't just do the normal the basics i show the places that they've lived in abuja somebody had been in abuja for 10 years and never been to certain areas but as she saw it on my channel i was really impressed to hear that i was really i felt so happy and a day without posting anything on this channel makes me feel sick yes i know it might sound cliche but that's the truth that's just the honest truth i love to bring you guys you know all the content you love to see um nav valley is a very clean estate one of the things i didn't see or notice in this estate is i didn't hear generator sound and i didn't also see um, some houses had in in um solar solar panels like these houses you are seeing here they all have solar panels so i didn't take note to know if all the roofs were on solar panels but most of the roofs roofs i saw were with solar panels so i don't know how their light situation is is here but of course i'm sure if they have light issues then we'll be hearing the noise of generator blaring everywhere but in this case you can see uh, solar panels that we are seeing everywhere so apparently it's a rule that you will not have you can see the solar panels now it is a rule that you're not bringing your generator here because right now there are so many estates in abuja where you are not allowed to bring generator here guys are you seeing how beautiful this estate is i love 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 like i used to say because god knows that i love beautiful houses beautiful estates when it's time for me to build i'm going to build a very beautiful edifice because i love beautiful places so now if you are coming from let's say the city center like i said earlier uh nav valley is on your left but you have to go through your right you have to go through the right instead of going straight 
down to Nyanya Karo. You go after AYA, you go off to the right, then you turn left and drive to Na Valley. That is where the estate is. Most people will come to Abuja and they're looking for places to stay that is very, very serene and quiet. They love to go to Na Valley. Whenever we mention, because we have a property firm, K and Penny Properties, and he's been in existence for almost 14 years. And um, like I said in most, I've said in most of my videos, we help people get good properties. We help people buy. We help people manage properties. So basically, we have clients that have houses in that valley that we manage for them. And in this case, we we're just thinking, where have we not toured? And I just said, okay, why not we tour Navali? Even though Navali is in Asokoro, that's why it's very pricey. Yeah, it's because it's even an estate like this. That's why normally, if it is not a very big estate like this, I'm sure the prices will be going to 10 million. And if things don't go down very soon, these places will be going for like 10 million naira per annum, depending on the type of house you are renting. Inside the Navali, they have schools here. So if you live in this place and you're looking for a school for your children it's not going to be a difficult tax for you to find a school a church you know a mosque for those who are muslims they have places here for places of worship for you so basically navali is a very beautiful serene estate with good road networks everything you want to do in navali you can do it inside the estate without having to go out to do it but most people come from here to the city center to to you know they come from here to the city center to work. Some actually come here to work also that because some people have offices inside Nav Valley. So those people who live in other places very close to Nav Valley, they come to Nav Valley for their offices to work here. So imagine just look how beautiful. Just just take a look, guys. Take a look. This is this place is giving what it should give. Hundred over hundred minus nothing minus nothing. I love Navali so much. I've been meaning to come to this estate for the longest. And guys, just drop on the comment. What other place do you want me to tour for you? Like, if you have watched the other video, you'd have seen how beautiful the places I promised to tour. You can see almost every roof here is having the solar panel. And I hope that... I don't think these people allow anything generator because i didn't hear any generator sound while i was there we didn't hear any generator sound the place is this when they say nav valley it really suits the name because there were a lot of valleys here you if you uh, you get to a point where you'll be seeing the express from the other side leading to a filling station that place is really a a valley like a real valley and they were able to you know control the area you know put the buildings intact and such as and i don't know the people that built this place i don't know the people that really built this estate because they did a great job they tried to control you know the junior system they did a lot of things here and they also have very good security network here they have good security because there are places you get to each end you see they have this military you know um security post where it's like this water tanks you are seeing at the end of each side of the estate where they stay to use their this thing such light to check to see if they will see kidnappers arm robbers and all of that so this is the area this place is so deep it is really valuable because i zoomed it you are not seeing it that well so this is the other side of the express this is their back gate you can see how beautiful this place is really beautiful and this house here the place is so deep it's just that i did not capture it the way you can see the hill here we're coming out of the place it's really really healing and uh, some houses here are still under construction most people have not finished their some are trying to renovate their houses to give it out you could see all those places see how beautiful the houses are most places are owned by senior air force officers retired most of them are still in service they got you know properties here and um, some of their officers live here rented why some they live here because they were allo they allocated the plot to them at the time they were to buy so most of them when they send you know how all these military personnel are being transferred from one place to the other so most of them give out the houses for 
they give out the houses for rent and some sold the houses out but i don't know for me i feel that if you have a house in this kind of beautiful place there's no point selling it i'll just keep it and be collecting rent because if rent here for a duplex is going for seven million six million six point five it's a good deal like wherever you are you can send your children to school comfortably and you understand it would be great so i just felt that mm, let me show my viewers this beautiful estate let's see what they can do do you want to invest here do you want to live here there are other places that you can see from the left those houses are not occupied yet people are still buying some people have bought but they, they don't have money to fix the place so if you still want to buy it's you can come here and buy as big as this estate is you know hear noise like you know there are people who love to live in very quiet and peaceful environment they don't like stress so if you are thinking of a place that like i've mentioned how much houses go for here you can see houses here for except somebody is giving you a bq and their bq is like two million those people that rent the main building the whole building they rent it for maybe six million they give out the bq for two million some landlords are kind enough or some people who are tenant who rented these places are kind enough to give it to like maybe two point some people give for 2.5 some give for 2 million some give for 1.5 and sometimes the bq some bqs are two rooms like two people can live two separate people can live there so some people give for 1.5 some give for 2 million and because it's in asokoro you understand some people just want to make you know this name that they live in asokoro you get then they will now go and rent a bq for 2.5 million like i don't understand well some people they say it's uh packaging they're trying to um uh, where you live matters those kind of stuff you know so who am i to say no it's good good branding and all but if you are trying to start life i don't think it's necessary to just be living a life that you are not able to but if you can afford it it's fine if you can afford the life why not by all means leave it by all means live the life and enjoy mm -hmm. so you can see how clean this place is they ensure that they have cleaners people that come here to clean these places and make it very neat so you can find out that while we're all touring here nobody had seen anything litter around that this is a suya joint and kilishi joint that they have in the estate the estate is basically a place where you can even stay you can sit out you can do everything within the estate like it's everything is within this estate you don't need to even go how to do anything even though so for some people going out is good like for me i told you guys i don't go out like if i'm not creating content because one of the reasons i went out is to go get content for you guys that's just the reason why i went out outside that i don't have okay i went to work from the office i went out to create content that's how important you guys are and do you know fuel is so expensive and scarce in abuja so but in all of that i don't care as far as my viewers can see something to watch that's the most important thing right now it, in fact we need some people were queuing but we are lucky to buy and then we proceeded to nav valley the one of the most beautiful estates in abuja there are people that if you give them metama they will tell you no they will live in nav valley so so many of our clients love nav valley to the point that whenever they want to buy a house except for those whose monies were not enough for the particular property they needed those are the ones that you know didn't get those houses here because they like this the serene environment they like the peaceful the well organized area and all of that so a lot of people are still working on their properties like i mentioned earlier nav valley is beautiful what do you think please comment let's know what do you think about nav valley estate a lot of people have heard of nav valley estates i know some people will come to me and say hey how did you even go to these places you must have been spending somebody told me you must have been spending so much going to do this tour because the person knows how most of these areas are very far from where i stay like my office i work in meitama and then i went to asokuro to go and tour so you can imagine it's not easy and um and i you know all of those so basically the goal is for us to ensure that we give you the best for you to see her, the beauty of abuja we are here to sell how beautiful abuja is how clean abuja is we are not a dirty people yes we are not dirty abuja is clean you can see the roads here are marked for those people who have been dragging us oh why are the roads not marked and no nav valley estates roads are marked nav valley estate um has solar 
energy so we i'm sure some people use inverter so we don't know about the light system here even though i have a friend who lives here i've never seen them use generator so i don't know if they allow them use generator in this estate but basically if you are coming here just to you can see all the roofs this side have um solar panels so mm, if you think but of course generator noise is what i hate even as i'm doing this voice over there's a generator very close to my house in another estate but in the sound is getting to my own estate you can imagine what the people in that estate will be passing through i don't just like generator noise anyway but the light situation sometimes can make you want to just you know buy a gen set and then keep the life going so guys tell me what do you think about this estate is it giving what it should be giving is it giving 10 over 10 minus nothing what do you think they would have done better or, or do you think they have done excellently well was this what you were expecting to see about nav valley estate if this is what you expected if they didn't met the standard of all the hype like i mentioned the security post you see that green um this green high-rise um post here is where the military men stay to do their searchlight at night to go around search around to see that no wrong movement you know how military people don't joke with all of this so they just want to ensure that everybody who lives in this estate is secure and i've never from the start of nav valley i've never heard even for from when people were just a few of them living here i've never heard that there was a security security challenge in nav valley i've never heard that anybody was waylaid or a, there was burglary of in of of sort nothing like that no arm robbery no burglary nothing nobody has ever boggled here and there's no issue like that so guys um what do you think about the estate will you can you live here let me know um do you think that this estate is worth the hype let me know guys thank you so so much if you have watched this video to this point i want to thank you so much for the love for always watching my videos to the very end for always you know sharing my videos or always liking the video because a lot of people watch my videos and like it because whenever you like my videos it helps youtube to recommend the video to you know a lot of viewers but when you don't like it it limits their the visibility it will get but please guys help me like the video help me share the video by so doing and supporting the channel thank you so so much i don't take your effort and love on this channel for granted you guys are super amazing i i actually brag about my subscribers and followers i brag about you guys whenever people are talking about people that come to their channel i basically brag about you guys um so you can see the up those up hills there's a, a recreational center there that you must have seen in one of my videos before this one so guys thank you so 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 much for all the love and support i'll keep thanking you and i'll never get tired of saying thank you that's a mox there that sign showing that there's a mox in that place for those who are muslims then for the christians they have their own place of worship which you have seen as we are going into this place so guys what do you think is there any other place you want me to tour please guys a lot of people have dropped places they want me to tour but they were not able to give me a precise or um a definite address i don't know if that's the english language suitable for that as in a, i want you to give me a good landmark so that whenever i'm going to tour because most of these estates you mentioned they also have estates in other districts so if you mention the estate without giving us a proper landmark it will be difficult for us to locate the place so please guys thank you so so much for the love the support god bless you i love this estate so much and i don't know if you love it the way i do you you are seeing that view there that's a recreational center um you would have watched it in a video before this one thank you so much guys god bless you god bless you immensely i i truly like words to how much i am grateful i don't know how to express it you know how you are very happy and you know no thank you for watching see you in the next one bye